Hey guys, this is an unboxing of the Microsoft Art Keyboard. Now, we're going to take a look further into this later on, but at the moment we're going to look at the box. Now, knowing Microsoft, they have nice designs in their box. So, these are kind of like, you can keep these boxes because you know they're nice. It's thin. I mean, as you can see, the white really stands out with a keyboard here. Here, let's go over some key features, what it says. Now, the first one, it says, show it off. So, it's obviously got to have some style to it. It's lightweight. Definitely is lightweight. And it's USB only. If you can see this down here, USB only. Now, another cool feature with this keyboard is it does work with both Windows and Mac. So, that is a universal keyboard. So, let's unbox this and take a look further into it. So this is what we we look at when we open the box. Now I have already unboxed this so you will see some of the contents missing. So as you can see it comes in this nice, I don't know how to say it, protective coat cover. Now in the box, as you can see there's nothing in the box. There was something in the box, but now there's nothing in the box. There was a CD here for the installation, which sometimes you do not need because Windows Update will take care of that for you. And this is only where the batteries go for the keyboard, but they're already in the keyboard, so I'll show you that a bit later on. Right, get to the keyboard. As you can see, they've packaged it really well, so you can take care of your product. I mean, it opens up, see it, kind of like a house. I'm going to pull this out. Now this is the keyboard. This is the full keyboard. Now, we're going to take a look on the box. And as you can see, it is the same thickness. It's the same design, it's perfect. Picture perfect. Now if we go to look at it, these keys, I don't know if you can see that. They're more chiclet keys, more like a Mac keyboard. They're really spaced out and easy to type with. Um, as you can see, it's got a really nice black sleek design. One thing I would say with this black model, is you do attract fingerprints it's just like crazy fingerprint on the back of it is really nice white and plain simple setup right this is a USB to connect it with so if we can look at this USB it is really really small now I'm not gonna say much about these USB because everyone knows what a USB is if you don't it goes into the computer and connects to the outputting device. Now, as another feature, which is cool, so you don't lose this, because it did say on the box it's lightweight and portable. It's magnetic, so I'm going to leave this here. Look, can you see that? I'm not holding it. But I don't know if you can hear that, but watch this. It's magnetic, see? I'm going to try to chuck this out. Nothing, still there. Right here is a battery compartment. Now it takes AAA batteries, two of them, which it does already come within the box, so you're ready to go. Um, the grip here, here, and here in all four corners do support it from not moving. Not as much as you would expect it to, but it adds to the design that it doesn't move as much as normal plastic keyboards. Anyway, the turning on point, because if you look at there is no switch to turn this on. So to turn it on, you got a nice feature, you're going to press FN, you're going to press escape, because it already triggers off the on button. And if we look up in the top right hand corner here, when I press these two buttons, you will see the light come on. See that? That is to show that the keyboard is on and ready to connect. When you turn it off, you'll get a different light symbol. Flashing. That's it. So overall, I would recommend this device. Um, you do get great use out of it. I carry it to school in my backpack because I only take a small laptop to school. So you really do get perfect use from this. Thanks for watching.